Hey y'all, it's Casey, and today I'm gonna show you my top five tips for decorating your table when you guys are entertaining in your home. First things first, when you guys are setting your table, in the olden days, olden, my mom would set our table with placemats that are super cute and a way to specify a spot for each person, right? But today, I really love chargers. And there's some super cool ones out there. I'm obsessed with these natural round ones. I'm gonna link everything below, so don't you lady boos worry. Um, but first things first, when you're setting a table, start with a charger. All right, my second tip when setting your table is napkins. Not the old school paper ones you used when you were like in college, but like we're adults now, right? 30 plus, 30-ish, 25 plus, we're adulting, okay? It's time to invest in cloth napkins. I love these just natural beauties, um, this nude-ish color. I'll use them all the time. You can wash them, reuse them. I would just iron them before guests come over, but they're really, really easy and simple and they're actually not that expensive. Okay. Tip number three, and if you guys have followed along with me for a while or follow my blog, you all know I love flowers. So surprise, surprise, blooms are tip number three. Fresh flowers for the table goes such a long way. It's a great decor piece throughout your entire house, but I love them for when you're setting a table. You can see I have pink roses and hydrangeas right here. I also suggest to save some money if there's a local flower market, a farmer's market, or if you have a Trader Joe's where you live. These babies, such a good deal. I love the hydrangeas at Trader Joe's. Tip number four, mood lighting. So my mom always taught me that dining rooms should have a dimmer. But if you don't have a dimmer, but you still want to create mood lighting, you can do that nowadays with one, a real candle, which I like tea lights, but some people don't like to have flames on their actual table. And so the second option would be the LED lights that come in all different shapes and sizes. Some have timers. And then I put these in cute little containers like this or with tea lights, if you don't want to set them directly on the table, you can get little mercury glass babies like this. My last and final decor tip when setting your table is a table runner. I think it's just a great way to add texture to your table and it's the first thing I lay down in the center of my table to start building all of my other decor elements on top of it for my centerpiece. So my blooms, my candles, if I have cake stands, if I'm setting appetizers in the middle, it's just a very great way to set your table. All right, y'all, those are my top five tips for decorating your table. Let's do a little recap. First, charger. Second tip, cloth napkins. Third, flowers. Fourth, mood lighting. And fifth, a table runner. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. You guys have been asking me for more home decor and entertaining tips, so I hope this helped. Uh, if you have any questions, email me, comment below, and I'm gonna link everything I talked about as well below. Happy entertaining.